Happy Saturday, YouTube people. This is my first vlog post WBFF Worlds. About that, I know I'm a little bit behind on my series. I'll be honest with you, I'm just dropping the ball left and right. I've got a lot of content to edit. Um, but I promise I'll get to it soon, and I hope to have everything done in the next week or two. Um, camera's on the dashboard, it's moving, I got Mario Andretti here to my left, speeding through Brooklyn, which leads me to my next point. Um, we're going to be starting a new series on YouTube, and it's not going to be fitness related. Um, for those of you that have come over from my Instagram page, you may have noticed that I have quite the obsession with donuts. For those of you that haven't come from my IG page, well, now you know, I have a huge obsession with donuts. Um, so I'm going to be starting Dan's Weekly Donuts. I know, sounds riveting, super exciting, it's exciting to me, exciting to Louisa. Um, so we're kicking it off today. Oh, camera sliding. I'm just gonna grab it. Um, oh, and I can die like a normal person. So, uh, I'm way too close. We saw. Ah. Anyways, great start to this video. Um, we are in Brooklyn. It's one of Lisa's best friends from college. High school. High school. It's her birthday. Um, she lives in Brooklyn. Brooklyn happens to be home to <coughs> probably our favorite donut shop called Dough. So we left early. The party doesn't start till five. So we obviously left <laughs> early to make sure we had plenty of time to experience Dough. So now you guys know this is the kickoff to Dan's Weekly Donuts. Are you excited? <laughs> How excited? I'm pretty fucking excited. So we will catch you when we're in there. All right, guys. We made it. Look at this model. So we got the donuts, but it was a sauna in there. AC kicked in like while we were paying, but only for like a little portion of the the store. So we are about to be creeps <laughs> and just eat the donuts in Lisa's car. Stay tuned. First up to bat is the lemon poppy seed. <coughs> Look at the size of that donut. It's basically the size of my palm. We're about to dig in. Squeeze. Me? Yeah, your little squeeze. Look at that. Going in for the kill. Look at that grease. It was on there for five seconds. That's great. That's not grease. That's happiness. Good dough. It's good dough. That's why they call it dough. Alright. You guys get to watch me eat now. Mmm. That's good dough. It's good dough. Alright, it's so soft. It's so pillowy. It is like a pillow. It's great. Not overwhelming lemon flavor. No. And the poppy seed is very subtle. Yeah. 
Oh, this is great. Like, it, the lemon is just in the icing. Mm-hmm. Not yep. in the donut. But well, I think that's what they're known for, the dough. So. They don't want to F with that. Because they got it down. And yeah, I'm weird. I need some hot coffee with donuts. I got hot coffee. It's not a 90 degree day. It's 95 degrees outside. Just the Colombian in me. You mean someone's judging us? Oh, probably. Yeah, there's some woman on a stoop. <laughs> I think she's laughing. Here we got round two. This is the toasted coconut classic uh, this might actually be bigger than the first one definitely a good thing it's like the first knuckle yeah pretty much all right let's cut into this air pocket there look at that going in for the kill toasted coconut Good? Good? Guys, if you want to comment down below and rate us on a 1 to 10 on creep level, <laughs> you go for it. Let us know what you think. Alright, you know, we've accepted it. We give ourselves an 11. But it's all for the donut. That's good. Great toast on the coconut. On the coconut. I can't even speak. Wow, that's really good. Again, the flavor is just enough, but not overwhelming. Because none of these are the ones where they're like coated, coated. Right. Which they have those too. Just an FYI though, this one is a messier donut. Yeah. Just because all the toasted coconut crumble does kind of fall off a little bit so if you're eating it in a car like us just be mindful that you probably have coconut around your floor sorry Lisa round three guys how is it dance weekly donut when you've eaten more than one well I mean this was an unexpected trip this is the kickoff of the YouTube video series uh, here we have a horchata donut can't say I've ever had that one before. All right, get after it. Let the world know. Oh, it's like really soft icing. As the wind blows in the air conditioning or your hair, I should say. Uh oh, uh oh, a little messy. It's good. It's good. Uh huh. Mm. All right. You guys get to watch me eat now. How excited are you? Yeah, buddy. Here we go. I'm gonna dive in. Good cinnamon. You know what this reminds me of? Like, the very faint cinnamon toast crunch. Like the milk at the end, which is delicious. Is it all over me? On your pants. What about my lips? Alright. If you want to get off. That's really good. I'm gonna finish these off and we'll uh, end it with our re review. Alright. <coughs> Time for round four. Nah, I'm just playing. Um, so before we get into the commentary, Look at that murder scene. That only had two donuts on it. Only two donuts. We didn't even put the horchata on it. Awesome. That's just pure happiness. So, I think this edition of Dan's Weekly Donut, we started off with the best. Dough definitely cemented its position as our favorite, as our number one. We had the lemon poppy seed. We had the horchata. And, how did I forget the other one? Coconut, toasted coconut. The toasted coconut. All three of them were amazing. It's all about the dough for dough. They perfected it. It's soft. It's like memory foam. Um, my favorite, definitely the horchata. Horchata. Yeah. They had the most flavorful um, icing. Yep, 100%. The icing was great. Um, like I said, it reminded me of that milk at the end of Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Um, brings me back to my childhood. And yeah, 
three donuts later, you want three more, but we're not going to do it because hashtag goals. Um, and that's it. We'll check in next week for episode number two.